Welcome to the Trends Hub, your source for breaking news and trending stories from around the world. Breaking news Mississippi River Crisis, America's greatest waterway now our most endangered. The headline flashes across TV screens nationwide. Reporters stand on muddy riverbanks, their voices trembling with urgency. Only hours ago a magnitude 4.8 earthquake shook Missouri near the river's edge, startling millions awake in the early morning darkness. Sirens wailed, bridges shuddered, residents poured onto the streets searching for answers. The quake hit just days after a major environmental group named the Mississippi River the most endangered river in the country. News helicopters circle above, capturing images of churning waters and cracked riverbanks. Officials scramble to check levees, bridges, and power plants for damage as a sense of unease grows. Is the Mississippi River crisis a fluke, or a dire message from the Earth itself? The search for answers takes us into the heart of America's most important river. The Mississippi River is the backbone of America's heartland, a vital artery that has shaped the destiny of the nation for centuries. Stretching over 2,300 miles from the cold headwaters of Minnesota all the way to the warm, bustling delta at the Gulf of Mexico, it weaves through 10 states connecting distant communities and diverse landscapes. It carries not just water, but also the lifeblood of commerce, barges loaded with grain, coal and goods, while its fertile banks support millions of people and some of the world's richest farmlands. Yet beneath its calm surface ancient and powerful forces have shaped the land. Hidden faults and deep cracks snake through the earth, invisible to the naked eye but ever-present. These geologic scars were formed by violent earthquakes thousands of years ago, leaving behind a legacy that still lingers in the ground below. Most people living along the river have never felt a major quake. Life here seems tranquil, with families fishing or strolling by the water, unaware that the threat remains, unseen, often forgotten, but very real. The river crosses one of the oldest and most mysterious earthquake zones in North America, the New Madrid Seismic Zone, a place where the earth once shook with unimaginable force. Unlike California's famous visible faults, the dangers here are buried deep underground and rarely discussed, making them all the more insidious. The region's soft soils and wide floodplains can magnify the shaking from an earthquake, spreading destruction far beyond the epicenter and threatening towns, farms, and infrastructure. The Mississippi is both a symbol of strength and prosperity, and a source of hidden peril that could strike without warning. What lies below its waters could change the course of history once again, just as it has in the distant past, reminding us that even the mightiest rivers can hide ancient dangers beneath their surface. Teams of scientists have turned advanced technology toward the mysteries under the Mississippi. Using ground-penetrating radar, seismic sensors and satellite imaging, they've uncovered a web of cracks and faults hidden beneath the river's muddy bed. For the first time researchers can map weak spots that were invisible before. Some fractures are new, appearing only in the last year or two, others are ancient scars. In some places sensors have picked up strange movements, tiny shifts in the earth, as if something is stirring far below. Some cracks run directly under major bridges and levees raising alarms. The use of new technology proves the river sits atop a restless, unpredictable landscape. Every day satellites and sensors send back fresh data, painting a clearer picture of the dangers lurking beneath America's main artery. Deep in the heart of America, beneath the tranquil surface of the Mississippi River, lies a hidden danger, the New Madrid Seismic Zone. This fault system stretches from northeast Arkansas, through southeast Missouri, and into western Tennessee and Kentucky, quietly threading its way beneath small towns and farmland. While most people think of California's San Andreas Fault when they hear about earthquakes, the New Madrid Zone is less famous but, in some ways, even more threatening. Its quiet reputation belies the immense power it holds. In the winter of 1811 to 1812 this region was rocked by a series of massive earthquakes, some of the most powerful ever recorded in North America. The ground shook violently, terrifying settlers and Native Americans alike. The Mississippi River itself was forced to flow backward for several hours, a rare and astonishing event. Land buckled and heaved, rising in some places and sinking in others, forever altering the landscape. Huge cracks split open the earth, swallowing trees, houses and anything in their path. The shockwaves from these quakes traveled astonishing distances, 
shaking cities as far away as Boston and Washington, D.C., and rattling windows hundreds of miles from the epicenter. One of the most dramatic changes was the sudden creation of Real Foot Lake in Tennessee, formed overnight as the ground shifted and water rushed in, leaving behind a hauntingly beautiful landscape dotted with submerged trees. These earthquakes reached magnitudes up to 7.5, powerful enough to level entire cities if they struck today. Modern infrastructure would be at serious risk, and millions could be affected. Today, few living Americans in this region have experienced such devastating force, but the threat remains ever-present. The peaceful scenery hides a restless earth beneath. Ancient faults beneath the surface are still active, and recent tremors serve as a reminder that this zone is far from dormant. Scientists continue to monitor the area closely, watching for signs of renewed activity. Experts warn that the new Madrid seismic zone is overdue for another major earthquake. Preparation and awareness are crucial, as history shows this hidden hotspot can awaken with little warning, changing the course of the Mississippi and American life once again. In recent months, scientists and local officials have noticed new warning signs along the Mississippi. Small earthquakes, microquakes, have become more common, clustering near new cracks and faults. Residents report sudden dips in roads, tilting trees, and water bubbling up where the ground has shifted. Levy inspectors have flagged unexpected leaks and bulges, signs that the ground beneath is moving. Minor quakes and cracks can be early warnings of something far larger. The river is sending messages if only we know how to listen and respond. The Mississippi River is lined with vital infrastructure. Bridges, pipelines, levees, dams, power plants, and entire cities depend on it. Many of these lifelines were built before the full earthquake risk was understood. The river's soft soils can amplify shaking, making even moderate quakes dangerous. In 2008, a minor quake near Memphis forced engineers to shut down the Interstate 40 bridge for inspection. In 2011, flooding exposed cracks in levees near Cairo, Illinois, raising fears of collapse. A major quake could destroy dozens of bridges, rupture pipelines and shut down power plants. Dams and levees could fail, unleashing floods on towns downstream. Hospitals, schools and emergency centers in St. Louis and Memphis sit in harm's way. The Mississippi region, with older and less prepared infrastructure, could fare even worse than places like California. The risk is real, and growing as the cracks beneath the river widen. Imagine a major earthquake striking the Mississippi River region today, a disaster on a scale few Americans have ever witnessed in their lifetimes. The heart of the country, home to millions, would be shaken to its core in a matter of seconds. The violent shaking would ripple out for hundreds of miles, rattling cities and small towns alike, from the vast Great Plains all the way to the rolling hills of the Appalachians. Even communities far from the epicenter would feel the earth move beneath their feet. Bridges and highways, vital arteries for travel and commerce, would twist, buckle, and collapse. Emergency responders and supply trucks would find themselves stranded, unable to reach those in desperate need. The economic fallout would be staggering. 60% of U.S. grain exports move along the Mississippi River, and any major disruption could send shockwaves through global food markets, causing prices to soar and shortages to ripple worldwide. Factories and warehouses would grind to a halt, assembly lines would stop, and trucks would be left waiting outside closed distribution centers. The flow of goods across the continent would be paralyzed, affecting everything from groceries to electronics. Oil and gas pipelines could rupture, sparking massive fires or causing fuel shortages that reach as far as Chicago, New Orleans and beyond. The nation's energy infrastructure would be at risk, compounding the crisis. Thousands could be injured or killed by falling buildings, collapsing bridges, or catastrophic flooding from failed levees. Emergency crews would be stretched thin, racing against time to save lives in devastated neighborhoods. Hospitals might be left without power or clean water struggling to care for the injured. Families could be forced to evacuate, carrying only what they can, and crowding into temporary shelters as they wait for help. The region's supply chains, everything from groceries to gasoline, would break down. Supermarket shelves would empty, gas stations would run dry, and millions could find themselves waiting in long lines for basic necessities. The Mississippi River crisis is not just a threat to property, it's a danger to lives, livelihoods, and the stability of the entire nation. Preparing for such a disaster is not just wise, it's essential for America's future. Despite the risks, many people living along the Mississippi River know little about the earthquake danger. 
emergency drills are rare, and few families have quake plans or supplies. This lack of awareness could turn a natural disaster into a human tragedy. Experts say education is key, people need to know how to drop, cover and hold on during a quake. Cities must update building codes and hospitals and power plants should have backup systems ready. Simple steps, like keeping emergency food, water and batteries can save lives. The cracks beneath the Mississippi are a call to action for everyone. Hope lies in preparation. The more we know and plan, the safer we will be. Today, scientists monitor the Mississippi River and its hidden faults with the latest technology. Satellites, seismic sensors, drones and radar. Every signal is studied and shared with officials across the region. The fresh cracks beneath the river may be warning signs that pressure is building. No one can predict the exact moment of the next big quake, but the danger is real and growing. Preparedness is everyone's job. Learning safety steps, making disaster kits, joining community drills. The Mississippi River, mighty and mysterious, deserves our respect. With knowledge, preparation and courage, the next chapter can be one of survival and strength, not tragedy. The time to act is now. The river's future, and ours, depends on it.